Greetings from Mucus Asylum Stadium in Luniapolis, Craziana, where fans are burning effigies of GM crying pigskin in protest of his latest trade that sent three players to Grim Bay in exchange for a sack of toasters. Today's matchup is going to be a good one. The teams take the field. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> Hope you got your mutant tailgate buzz on. I know I did. The teams are revving up on the sidelines, and we are ready for some mutant football. Grim Blitzer along with Bricks and Bricks Jr. Yeah, Grim, I had a little eye open at myself at the mutant bloodmobile park next to the taco truck outside. Called a lobotomy shot. Raccoon rabies blood and red bull crap. Hoo-hoo. Yeah, I can tell your mouth looks like a hot shaving cream dispenser. And it's first and ten. He's supercharged and... Oh, and he fumbles the ball on that hit. When you hurdle and get hit, chances for a fumble increase. He scores! He earned those points on the heels of an epic run. Ah, don't call things epic, Grim. Kids aren't going to think you're cool no matter what you do. Junior, I don't want kids to think I'm cool. And they line up for the extra point. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chimp wearing a wig. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that. It sounds like my off season. And it's first and ten. First down to keep the drive alive. And it's first and ten. coming. Get 
something going here. And it's first and ten. Not much there, maybe a yard. Second down and nine. Quarterback passes for a touchdown. You know, the league used to flag this for excessive celebration. You know, refs really don't want to get too close to the rabbit roided out monsters. And don't even get me started on the werewolf. <laughs> Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double burrito from Taco Hell. The teams are lined up for the kickoffs. They're going to be able to return this one. First and ten. No, he just heard footsteps and try off the ball. What a peck ahead. Catch the ball, asshole. Second down and ten. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. They go to the ground game and pick up the first. Nicely done. And it's first and ten. Pick up seven yards on that play. Second and three. Pizza.
put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It's good. That's the end of quarter one. Well, the good news is there's still time to make it a game. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. And it's first and ten. And he pounds the ball and he's picking up seven. Second and three. Oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. And it's first and ten. First and ten. He's that guy's so fast he could strike lightning twice. Second down in a lot. Take off. He is deadly in the open field, Rick. And it's first and ten. The ground game to be their bread and butter. A gain of eight right there. Hey, anyone seen that Korean kid yet with my barbecue? Last time I ordered Korean, I got Kim Jong il. Third down and three. Ballsy? Stupid, maybe? I guess we'll decide after we see how this goes. But probably stupid. Now, there are some who would argue that we should defense says enough of this BS and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Yo, guys. Well, this shouldn't be easy, but with kickers, you never know. Goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make him pay.
And it's first and ten. Blow up the defense today. <laughs> he was right. First down and forever. Defensive. If he had getting killed by. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Straight through the uprights. They need a good return here to set up the offense. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. done for a first down and they quickly call a timeout to stop the clock and it's first and ten that's a killer it was right there and then he dropped it ah oh, scumbag is killing me in the fantasy league Second down and ten. And that's the way you play a guy. Nice coverage. Third down and ten. the way to move the chains that's good for a first down this game is all about momentum and killing and the offense quickly calls their second time out that's how you do it do what the offense goes into their two-minute drill what the hell is that same thing in the hurry up offense you moron I am and he just nailed him right on the numbers for a touchdown Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. And how about a little dirt sandwich?
And it's first and ten. Reminded of painting a dead car. short, but this one shouldn't give the kicker any trouble. Unless he collapses under pressure and never makes another kick again. Hmm. That's bleak, Bricks. And it's good! You know, Grim, in this league where murder and bribery are cheered, it's good to be good. Huh? I mean, can we all just... Not this shit again. Bricks, I'm... The second quarter... And these guys are neck and neck to begin the third quarter. You talking about them two Siamese twins playing opposing tackles? Yeah, they're putting on a hell of a show. I'm a hell of a fellow. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked One time, when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the night. It was just the visual tunnel that knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. First down! Bill sticking out a flimsy low hand's nose. It's a mare in long wages, Nevada. And it's first and ten. with the punishing hit. And it's first and ten. And that is caught for a first down. And it's first and ten. Mistakes here, just kick the ball through the upright for God's sake. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And it's first and ten.
Hey, Bricks, they're going for two here. And he makes the grab and adds two points to their score. And this guy has quite the female following. Listen to them. Yeah, they all want to jump his bones. I wish the middle linebacker would have jumped his bones. I just lost a saw buck on that play. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. You've got to avoid those spikes or you'll be a mutant pincushion. I was a chubby kid, Grim. My parents sent me to fat camp. My big brother told me as soon as he get there, stab the first kid you see and no one will mess with you. So I get off the bus at the camp, some kid runs up to me and stabs me. That's a nice gain of about seven yards on that run. Second and three. The chain's moving. That was beautiful. And it's first and ten. Murphy Brown! What? I mean, first down! What the hell was that? I, uh, I honestly don't know, Grim. like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> and the quarterback went in for the first down. Down in nine. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. He dropped it. If he does that again, they'll drop him. Third down and never gonna happen. And into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pass, he was off to the races. And they line up for the extra point. Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. Oh, he just got crushed. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Bad running. And that'll bring up second and one. First and ten. Oh, nice 
his head. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. Take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? The third quarter has ended, and we'll need a huge rally or a high death toll to make this one interesting. Third down, and, well, good luck. And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. four more downs to punish the defense and you better believe they will and it's first and ten catch big run big touchdown yeah big deal mr beat for break man with a ball didn't fall down It shouldn't be easy, but with kickers, you never know. It's good. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck off. That was just a one-time thing. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not young. And it's first and ten. Man, oh man, he hit that line the way your wife hits the all-you-can-eat buffet of crab apple trees, Bricks. Ah, uh, you're telling me. She ate 47 Salisbury steaks one time. Thought she had food poisoning. Turns out her low intestines just exploded. Oh, that's a relief, because there's nothing worse than food poisoning. Oh, you telling me? The quarterback goes down. Zoom on his face. I want to see if he's crying. Second down in a mile. Second down and six. Wolf speed and gauge. What are you trying to impress your nerd face to bring the game? Oh, 
Third down and long. Now it looks like he wanted to run before he caught it. You got to keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirtbag. You got to make that catch. You know, sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. Nice punt. Should move him back nicely. He's got the ball now. Ouch! What is this? Andy's wrestling? And it's first and ten. the field incomplete he threw it but no one could catch it some things like that in the quarterback second down and ten and an eight-yard gain on that one like when bricks's mom decided to move back in with us third and two He just got crushed. And it's first and ten. Oh, devastating hit. You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep. Third grade. Sister Mary Margaret of Our Ladies of Holy Hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. First and ten. Don't, don't die. See, it's really a slow game when it comes down to it. Smart move there as they call a timeout trying to get the ball back for another shot. And it's first and ten. heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick. Get the ball, asshole. Hey, up here. Talking to you. And he pounds the ball into the defense, picking up seven. The defense has to make something happen here with one timeout left. Third down and three. He had it for a second there. They get ready for the kick. This isn't a gimme. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty. Huh. I didn't know that was a penalty. Yeah, these rule changes are ruining the game, Brown. Man, these guys have offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. Thank God he's still got his leg. He's going to need all of it for this kick. Hey, a sawbuck says he misses. Well, surprise me. He made it look easy, and he gets three points for it. The 
The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he made this clothing company, Lukewarm. Oh, and that one's going to hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. First in. They've called a zap attack. The ball carrier better move his ass. Devastating hit knocks the ball loose. And the off. And that hit jars the ball loose. And it's a fumble. That's what happens when you hurdle and take a hard hit. Okay, nice knee like a two foot. You miss two foot putts all the time, Grim. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. of a rutabaga after that hit. The offense changes the pace by going into a hurry-up. Does that mean the defense gets into a hurry-up, too? Man, can I kill him? Boom! Second down. It burns his last time out. They can't stop the clock anymore. And the hurry-up offense wears out the defense. Scrambler. The Colts walk away victors today. They come up big today with a solid win, and the opposition will be licking their wounds on the long plane ride home. I heard wounds taste just like chicken. How was it? Scrambles tomato soup. Wounds. Mm -hmm. Good. The MVP is about to inspire us with some words of wisdom. Yeah, right. Putting three words together for this guy is like you doing a Rubik's Cube. What's a Rubik's Cube? Moving on. Okay. okay. Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by the Hexon Oil Corporation. We drill it, spill it, and kill it so you...